Welcome back to the Super Memory for Schools program. I'm Win Hu Tan. Today we are back to the English program, Grade Four. Family and Friends Special Edition, Grade Four, Unit Five: A Funny Monkey. Lesson One: Words. In this lesson, let's go to the zoo, and you can see lots of zoo animals. Are you ready? Let's go. Hey, students. Let's go to the first part of our lesson today. In our lesson today, we will have some new words about the zoo animals. Here we go. What's this? Let's listen and repeat. Penguin. 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 Hey, students. Penguin. Penguin is an animal with two short wings. And it can swim, but it cannot fly. Let's say penguin. Good job. And next, zebra. 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 Hey, students! Zebra is an animal which looks like a horse. Zebra is black and white. It can run very fast. Let's say zebra. Monkey. 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 Hey, students. This is a monkey. Monkey is a zoo animal. Monkey can climb the tree, and it has a long tail. Let's say monkey. Good job. Kangaroo. Kangaroo, kangaroo. Hey, students! Kangaroo is a zoo animal too. Kangaroo can jump high, and you can see a kangaroo in Australia. And kangaroo has a big bag. Let's say kangaroo. And next, camel. 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 Yes, camel is a zoo animal too. Camel is a big animal, and a camel lives in the desert. In the desert, it is very hot, and it has lots of sand. And the camel lives in the desert. Lizard. 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 This is a lizard. The lizard is very colorful. Sometimes the lizard is green, but sometimes the lizard is red, orange, or gray. It's colorful, and the lizard is small, and it can climb the tree. You can see it on the rock. Let's say lizard. Crocodile. 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 Yes, crocodile is a zoo animal, and the crocodile is a dangerous animal. Be careful and keep far from crocodiles. Sometimes the crocodile is green. And it often lives in the swamp. It likes to eat meat. Students, let's say crocodile. Hey, students! It's time for you to listen and repeat. Listening forty-four. Listen and point. Penguin. Zebra. Monkey. Kangaroo, camel, lizard, crocodile. Hey, students! So easy, right? We have some zoo animals, and now I have a game for you. In this game, you can read and answer. For example, I will show you a picture. 
and you can read. And you tell me which animal that I'm talking about. Let's read. This animal can swim, and it has two short wings. Do you remember? Which zoo animal is it? Of course, it's a penguin. Students, let's say penguin. And it's time for you to read. This animal can run fast, and it is black and white. What animal is it? Is it a horse? No, it looks like a horse. It's a zebra. Hey, students, let's say zebra. Good job. The next question. This animal can climb the tree, and it has a long tail. What animal is it? Yes, it's a monkey. Students, let's say monkey. Good job. And next, this animal lives in the desert. Which animal is it? Hmm. Yes, it's a camel. Students, now listen and repeat. Camel. Next. This animal can jump high, and it has a big bag. Wow! Which animal has a big bag, and it can jump high? Yes, it's a kangaroo. Students, let's say kangaroo. Kangaroo. So kangaroos live in Australia. Yes. Next, we have this animal can climb, and it likes to eat insects. What animal is it? It's a lizard. Students, let's say lizard. And next, this animal is very dangerous, and it lives in the swamp. Yes, it's a crocodile. Students, let's say crocodile. Good job. And next. This is the end of our lesson today. In this lesson, I hope you remember all the words about zoo animals. First of all, penguin with two short swings. Camel lives in the desert. The monkey can climb and has a long tail. The zebra can run very fast. It's black and white. The crocodile. Crocodile is very dangerous, and the crocodile lives in the swamp. Next, the kangaroo. The kangaroo can jump high and has a big bag. The lizard. The lizard can climb, and it likes to eat insects. So that's all for our lesson. Goodbye, and see you in the next lessons of the Super Memory for Schools program. Goodbye, and see you again.